Yo, tell me why this man right here, the wheels off the ground, trailer on this big ass hump. Shit crazy. This shit crazy. Tell this man to take his ass to a, a, a regular truck. This shit about to flip, gang. Bonehead truckers. <laughs> Certified bonehead. Come on, man. Oh, look at old FedEx back there. Uh, shame on the mess. Come on, man. Congratulations, you're gonna be on bonehead truckers. You're gonna be a trucker? Look at this bonehead trucker. Bonehead trucker. This is not where you park at, holding this guy up. Heartland Express, bone head truck. Park there to get a scale ticket. Bl holding up the scale. Bone head trucker. Taking forever to pull off. Bone here still in the move yet. Holding this guy. Taking her precious time. Okay, bonehead trucker. Where you gonna leave? Bonehead trucker. Come on, man. This is why I don't pull into Loves. All these people just sitting at the pumps. Nobody pumping. Not one. Come on, man. No parking on fence line. What has this guy been doing for the last 45 minutes? That's why. Look, 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 Hey, welcome to Tales from the Truck Stop. It is Christmas Eve, or Christmas whenever you watch this. It may be New Year's by the time you watch this, but I appreciate you watching this. Taking your time out to watch, so hit that like button, subscribe. And uh, hey, uh, since it's Christmas time, uh, leave me a nice Merry Christmas comment, all right? That's your Christmas present to me, and I appreciate it. If you've got uh, videos, clips you want to send to see on Bonehead Truckers, send them to contact at boneheadtruckers.com. That's our email address. So join our Facebook group, Say No to Bonehead Truckers. All right, and you can just post videos, pictures there. You can talk to us too. It'd be great. It'd be great. We got a bunch of this. And what I mean by this is, well, boneheads, but come on, guys. Can we start filming in landscape mode? We're, what? We're on YouTube. You guys are sending me videos. Oh, for YouTube, okay, so turn that phone sideways. I mean, everybody, all the viewers will like it. See those little black strips on the side? Now, uh, yeah, this guy, I don't know what, I guess he's sliding his tandems on the freaking Catskill. That's a big no-no. He actually says not to do it. Here, well, here we go. N another freaking, I can't film in landscape mode guy. Yeah, guy parked it the wrong way. Listen. I get it. Some of these trucks, the, their depth tanks are on the right side or the wrong side of the truck. But you'll come in here and do this. 
right? Now, I, I doubt this one does, but why are you going to come in here and do this? You know, if, if, if your depth tank is on the other side, man, just go buy a th freaking jug. I don't know what CRST is doing right here, but man, these, these police officers are serious about it. They are absolutely serious about it. What'd you do? Uh, what'd you do? He uh, got him. Got him. I guess they're going to arrest him for wearing flip flops. Hey, don't you know real truckers don't wear flip flops? You're under arrest. Uh, anyway, and we got more people blocking the freaking cat scales. Which I don't get. I, I, I just don't know. People are just so freaking selfish. That's my biggest pet peeve. Well, well, one of my biggest pet peeves is all these selfish people. I don't give a crap. Now, I know trucking is hard. It really is. You know, and backing a trailer up is hard. But do you really need a spotter backing up a bobtail? <laughs> we having a hard time these days in 2023. It's almost 2024. I wonder if things will get any better. <laughs> I guess you could tell my voice ain't really fully back, is it? No. Nope. Hey, uh, yeah. Uh, look at here. This is the reason why Bucky's don't want truckers in their freaking property. I'm just saying. I'm just sitting there saying. Uh, this is my pet peeve right here. People blocking the fuel island. Why? Because they had to go inside and go get them a cheeseburger and a sody water. Right? Now what they do? Get them a hot dog off the rollers. What? Ah, oh, geez. Shame on the mess. You can get that stuff later on. Get your fuel. Get up on out of the way. That's why I'm sitting there saying, golly. Man, if your ass watching this, I'm throw y'all ass on bonehead truckers right now. This goddamn guy parked no first, and it says no parking right there. And the reason why no parking because we need a swing room for the truck to get off the scale. And my truck is right here and I got a long frame. I can't make a U-turn around here. Yeah, he's not, then he's going to tell me to kiss, kiss his ass. Truck number 779. Throwing your ass on bonehead truck and letting your ass know. Throwing your ass on bonehead truck. Bonehead truckers, I got a nice one for y'all. So here we're gonna go with, I don't know if you can see it, but you know, you got a lot of these spaces that is clearly marked for handicap parking. Let's go around to the truck here. Try for the glare. because I can only do in come into 30 seconds, but clearly marked. Clearly marked. Nobody in the truck. Truck's cold. New person for bonehead. But then you got this one right next to it. Second one for bonehead. And this one, he's one of them ones that you always see. Look at it. Clearly marked. Wow, really? Taking up a space for a truck, but also marked for handicap. Both of them. Go figure. Bonehead trucker of the week, right here. Times two. Two different people. This is not some place that's going to tell you, wake you up at four or five o'clock in the morning and tell you, hey, time to get up, go to work. You got to be self motivated. Thanks for watching. I hope that helped you guys understand a little more about TRC Freight. If you have any questions or comments, please reach out to us, trcandme.com.